Hey everyone, it's Johnny from Vertigia. I want to demo how our autonomous agents can actually think through difficult problems similar to how a human would. So in today's demo, I'm going to do something kind of interesting. I'm going to upload three completely different documents to the Vertigia platform. And then I'm going to have an agent analyze these documents in a very generic way. So you'll see I'm asking it to conduct a comprehensive analysis of the documents in the repository and then create a report. I'm also asking it to provide an explanation of how these documents relate to one another. Now keep in mind, these documents don't relate to one another. So we're gonna see this agent actually have to think through this problem. And so let's go ahead and see what it does. So before we jump into the platform in too much depth, I wanna show you the documents that we're giving it. So the first thing we're going to give it is a loan underwriting guideline. So this is a comprehensive document outlining the underwriting guidelines for a commercial loan. We also have a marketing plan. Again, completely unrelated, different company name, right? So no relation. So we're gonna have this agent essentially analyze each document and we're gonna see what it comes back with. Last one we have is a commercial insurance policy. So. Again, I won't spend too much time on these documents. I just want to show you that these are, you know, extensive, realistic documents. They even have tables in them with uh, tabular data. So without further ado, let's go ahead and upload these to the platform. And you can do that by simply dragging and dropping these into our content repository. So when you upload these to a, a completely empty repository, the platform is going to automatically generate schemas aka types that we call them in the platform and these are essentially just going to be schemas for metadata so generally it takes about a minute for something like three documents to be uploaded while these are processing let's go ahead and look at the type so you'll see the very first type was already created a few seconds ago now when i'm talking about types and schemas what i'm really talking about is a schema that the model will fill with metadata upon information being uploaded so this was automatically generated by AI agents in the background of our platform. And you can see there's a lot here. And what makes this really cool is that we can fully customize this. So maybe I want to get rid of this. Maybe I want to give it extra context so we can do what's called a micro prompt and we can give it extra context for a specific data point. So uh, let's go ahead and add to this that the format should always be uh, year, year, month, month, day, day, okay? So that's just another really cool feature in the platform. Now, by now, all of this should be done processing. You can see these are complete. So if we open one up, let's take the e-commerce marketing plan, for example, you can see all of the metadata from that schema was automatically generated. It also has all the text in the document as well. So. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to actually run an agent with that very broad prompt and we're going to see what the agent does so to run an agent from within vertigia's ai studio you can come right here now this is generally used for testing out use cases and then once this is ready for uh production you would deploy this agent through an api that would be infused directly into a user's business application so what we're going to do is we're going to take what was on that PowerPoint slide and we are going to copy and paste it. So I need to get out of this there. Cool. All right. So you can see what we're asking it again. We're basically just giving it very broad instructions on creating an analysis. So let's go ahead and kick this agent off. First thing the agent's going to do is it's going to understand the tools that it has access to. This is going to be things like think, plan, update plan, update spreadsheet, analyze spreadsheet. So a lot of different tools here we're adding to this all the time. And then it's going to actually create a plan for itself, right? Step by step. So these agents are essentially autonomous workflows that will create the steps in their own workflow and they're powered by large language models. So we're going to let this run and then we're going to see what report it creates for us.
All right, so you can see the agent has finished. It's completed all the steps in its self-generated plan. It provides us with a summary now and it gives us a report. So in the next video, I'm actually going to dig into what the agent did, how it thought about this, and then the report that it generated.